doing the driving there as they get the line up. Good looking field here for the third race tonight. Live from Charlottetown, the Metro Home Building Center starting gate is rolling. And let's send it back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron. Now, Mac Napoleon, Windermere Frank, Salzburg Rocky, Rex Tishard, Molokov, E. Gamer, Kimbleby, Crispy Crunch, starting gate. So, wings round the turn. Entering the stretch. Now approaching a start. Fancy stepping at the rail, the one. How Mac Napoleon, there they go, up and pacing and leaving out. That's Windermere Frank. Rest assured is second. He came here from the outside, will be to the turn third. Malkoff fourth. Up the rail is How Mac Napoleon fifth. Then in six, Salzbrook Rocky, away seventh, Crispy Crunch. The trailer is Kimball B. Up the backstretch they go, led by Windermere, Frank, and Dowling. And here's E. Gamer and Kenny Murphy up to challenge on the outside. Third along the rail, that's rest assured. Racing from fourth is How Mac Napoleon. Then Malkoff is fifth, tapped out in sixth. This Salzbrook Rocky. Seventh is Crispy Crunch, then the trailer. Kimball B, the quarter's up in 29 and one. E. Gamer has taken over, but here comes Windermere Frank now back up and at him on the outside. Windermere Frank headed back to the point with Dowling. E. Gamer now second, Rex Deshard third. How Mac Napoleon fourth, Malkoff fifth, Salzbrook Rocky. He's sixth, then it's Crispy Crunch seventh, and the trailer. Kimball B at the midway point. Windermere Frank in 58 seconds flat. Going around the turn, approaching the 5 eighths now. Windermere Frank on top with E Gamer second. Here comes Mall Cop underway on the outside third. Rest assured at the rail fourth. How Mac Napoleon tips out fifth. Salzburg Rocky is sixth. Way wide and off stride now on the outside. Kimball B as traffic was tight. Going past the three quarters. Led by Windermere Frank in one. 28 and 1. Second is Mall Cop up into third. How Mac Napoleon. Fourth is Salzbrook Rocky. And they turn on for home. Windermere Frank, the leader, clear by two. Mall Cop is second. On the inside, How Mac Napoleon. Here's the line, and Dowling goes back to back. Windermere Frank wins. Second is Mall Cop. Salzbrook Rocky rallies up third. 156. Four! Wow! Here's a look at race number three tonight. And uh, Windermere Frank, where we said in the pre-race tonight, uh, Peter, that David Dowling, Earl Watts combination here tonight, Hollis Newtons, Newson, and Debbie Denny, they are excited to be back on track tonight. And this guy looked great. He didn't wait long when Dowling put him back into play, and that was the move. Here's his at his best shot right now. Winning move, and uh, as you mentioned, Lee, uh, early on he got to the front, uh, released uh, E-Gamer, who uh, took the lead briefly, 29-1. and one. David was out and around him before the half at 58-128-1, and one, and really it's all over here. Lights out and good night here as he's by himself at the line one. 56 and 4 That is a real good trip here and race number three at Red Shores tonight.
Well, Frank, David, and Albert, they teamed up for a big trip here in the uh, third race on this Saturday here in Charlottetown. They're in the winter circle. Windermere, Frank, Bay Pace, and Colt 3 by Malicious off the Shadow Play Dam. Overshadow, owned by Debbie Denny of Brooklyn, Nova Scotia, and Hollis Newson of Cornwall. Trained by Earl Watch, David Dowling, back-to-back -back for the double. Colt has a new record, 156 and 4. Windermere, Frank, in the third. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a late inquiry underway now in race number three. Late judges inquiring the third, examining the conduct going to three.